It's Saturday the 9th of November 2013, only 25 Central European time, and this, more correctly, there is where the magic takes place. <laughs> Brussels Museum van der Geurs, the Geurs Museum. Yeah, they're brewing today, so we're going to have a little look. Cleaning. It smells wonderful as well. Steam. That's the heating. Uh, it's packed with people. I'm not altogether sure what's going on. That's the shop anyway. Um, that's my complimentary creek. I've uh, got the camera out. Creek. Fruit here. That's the front here. And far more cherries. In fact, tons of cherries. That's an A. Another A. So here's the happy throng. So that's the bar. And about five minutes' time down that way, the English trip will start. Not that I speak Italian or Dutch or French. I'm not important. I do need to use my voice for the rest of the day. Well, the beer trip, that was epic. Epic sounds so poor. Excellent. So, take the Metro 6 from the Garda Midi to Heisel, come out, and this is what you've got. Yeah. It's... Oh. Uh, 
Gordon's Finest Scottish Highland Ale. Although it says here it's brewed in the Benelux. Whatever. Wonderful glass. Eight percent up of the volume. That's a bit strong for me. B plus. In a valiant attempt to keep my alcohol consumption under control, this is four and a half percent alcohol by volume. From Brasserie de la Seine. This is Dowerick. Which is a stout. Mm. A lightweight stout. And extremely drinkable. B. Plus. Just had the spark ball here, which is huge. And for the centre of Brussels, very reasonably priced. This is Ruzot. I can't even remember how strong it is. 6% alcohol by volume, which for Ravenshu is nothing. Wonderful glass, wonderful bottle. Bed. Oh, that's not bad. Not bad at all. Not great, but not bad. And maybe a session. This is top fermented by the way. B plus. Oh, more nibbles. 